Hello students, today I am going to start a new chapter of English language but before starting the chapter I would like to ask a question from you all. First tell me which part of the speech is this? Yes, you all know this. This is a noun. Now I am writing one more example. Now, boy is a noun. What is the use of this word naughty? This word naughty is giving more information about this noun word. So, the words which give more information about the nouns that are known as adjective. So, today our chapter is adjectives. Few more examples are there like the big path. Now in this example, park is noun and big is giving additional information about this noun word. So big is adjective. Next example is an intelligent student. Now again, Student is noun and this word intelligent is giving more information or you can say this word intelligent is describing this noun word so intelligent is adjective. Now students I am going to explain you kinds of adjectives. So the first one is adjective of quality as it is clear by the name that the adjectives which tells about the quality of noun the pronoun or you can say the adjectives which tell how a noun or pronoun is that are known as adjective of quality and you can identify this adjective of quality by asking the question with how. Now look at the examples. First one is the meaningful sentence. In this example sentence is noun and meaningful is telling about the quality of this noun word sentence. So, meaningful is adjective of quality. Next example, a long journey. Here again, journey is noun. And long is telling about the quality of this noun word journey. So, long is adjective of quality. Now, come to next example my comfortable sofa. Here again sofa is noun and comfortable is telling about the quality of sofa that is noun word. So comfortable is adjective of quality. You can ask, you can identify this adjective of quality by asking the question with how, how the sofa is. Sofa is comfortable. So comfortable is adjective of quality. Next is these yellow flowers. Here again Flowers is noun and yellow is telling about the quality of noun word flowers. So yellow is again adjective of quality. Okay. Now students third one is adjective of number. The adjectives which tells about the number of the nouns that are known as adjective of numbers. We can identify the adjective of numbers by asking the question with how many. For example, four children. Here, children is noun and four is telling about the numbers of this noun word. So, four is adjective of numbers. We can ask the question, how many children? So, what we will get as an answer? Four. So, four is adjective of number. One important point is that adjective of number we use with countable nouns and adjective of quality, quantity we use with uncountable nouns. Next is several books here. Books is your countable noun 
and several is telling around the number of this noun. So several is your adjective of number. Next example, few bed sheets. Here, bed sheets is countable noun. And few is telling about the number of this countable noun. So few is your adjective of number. The last example, many games. Again, games is countable noun. And many is telling about the number of this countable noun. So many is adjective of numbers. Now, fourth one is demonstrative adjectives. What is the meaning of demonstrate? Demonstrate means to show. So the adjectives we, that we use to show or to point out any noun that are known as demonstrative adjectives. We are having four demonstrative adjectives that are this, that, these and those. In these four, this and that we use for singular nouns and these and those we use for plural noun. This we use for the things which are near to us. That we use for the things which are far to us. In the same way, these we use for the things which are near to us. And those we use for the things which are far to us. Now come to the examples. This machine... That Almira these butterflies those paintings. Okay, now this machine in this example, machine is now. And when we will tell about any machine, so how we will tell this machine? We will point out that machine. So this we are using to point out the machine. So this is your demonstrative adjective. Next example, that Almira. Almira is noun. And that we are using to point out that Almira. So that is your Demonstrative adjective. In the same way, butterflies is noun. And these we are using to point out the butterflies. So these is demonstrative adjective. And the last example is the, those paintings. Paintings is noun. And those we are using to point out the paintings. So those is again demonstrative adjective. Now, Fifth one is interrogative adjectives. The adjectives which are used to ask questions that are known as interrogative adjectives. The words such as who, what, when, whose, which, where, these words are known as interrogative adjectives. Now come to the examples. First one is which is your favorite picnic spot? When we will ask this question, what we can get as, a, as an answer, it can be Indra Park, it can be Hathi Park, it can be Shimla. These all words, Hathi Park, Indra Park and Shimla, these all are noun words. So, we are getting a noun as, a, as an answer. So, this word which is your interrogative adjective. And we always put one question mark at the end of this type of sentences. Next example. What you are going to have in dinner today? So, in an, as an answer, you can get chapati, rice. So, these words chapati and rice are noun. So, again, we are using this word what for a noun. So, what is your interrogative adjective? Next is whose work is not done? So, what we can get as an answer? It can be Rahul, it can be Ria. So, Rahul and Rhea are nouns. So, again this whose is telling us about the noun. So, whose is your interrogative adjective. Now students, sixth one is possessive adjectives. The adjectives which we use to show possession or you can say ownership or belongings that are known as possessive adjectives. 
the words such as my are your their his her and its are known as possessive adjective for example my dog in this example dog is a noun and my is showing possession on this noun word so my is your possessive adjective next is your study room in this example study room is noun and your is showing possession on this study room so your is possessive adjective next example his milkshake again milkshake is noun and his is showing possession on this noun word so his is possessive adjective in the same way in this example presentation is noun and there is showing possession on this noun word presentation so there is your possessive adjective now students seventh one is distributive adjectives distribute means to divide something so the words which we use to distribute the members or things of a group or you can say the adjectives which we use to refer each one of the noun that are known as distributive adjectives the words such as each every either or and neither nor are used as distributive adjectives look at the example first one is each teacher is working hard in this example each is your distributive adjective next is every puzzle is being solved in this example every is distributive adjective next is either the doctor or the nurses are coming to attend the seminar in this example either or is distributive adjective and the last one is neither rahul nor radha got any prize in this example neither nor is distributive adjective now students eighth one is participle adjectives participles are exactly verbs but we use them as an adjective we are having two participles present participle and past participle present participles ends with ing and past participles end with en or ed for example talking tom here tom is a noun and talking is giving more information about about this noun word so talking is an adjective as this is a participle so this is known as participle adjective now next example crying baby here again baby is noun and crying is giving information about this noun word so crying is adjective again it is a participle so crying is known as participle adjective few hey, hey. more examples are there broken chair here broken is participle adjective painted wall in this example painted is participle adjective this is all about your kinds of adjectives thank you so much hey, hey, hey.